Welcome back to V-Rule, I'm Rob, and here we are on another video. Today is Tuesday where we talk about the different Pokemon news going on out there. I've expanded a little bit further beyond just the TCG because it's just interesting Pokemon related news that I have to share today. Before we get into that, the Galarian Articuno tin from Crown Zenith, that's going out to one lucky winner, two Stellar Crown three pack blisters to two additional winners, and then a Pokemon Mystery Prize to a fourth winner overall. I'm trying to grow this channel. We got to get to 2,500 subscribers. We have been climbing like crazy I appreciate the support and continuing as you go through these videos be sure to like comment down below and subscribe to the channel that is just a huge help and I can't thank you enough for every little bit that you do to contribute in that fashion it's free to do easy to do quick little click quick little type whatever you got to do but specifically let's go over to this video here that one is going to be the one where you need to comment and that's what's going to enter you for the chance to win. I'm announcing it in every video until we hit that 2,500 subscriber mark, but that way I can go back to that one, and there's a singular solid pool of everybody who's seen all these different videos along the way having their chance to be entered in to that giveaway, those four prizes there. Let's jump over here into some Pokemon news. We are on PokemonCenter.com here. You may or may not have access to Pokemon Center, but I want you to be aware of there is a new promo, a new Pikachu promo, coming out, uh, already out rather, uh, available to you as of August 2nd. That was the beginning of this. This is in preparation for Worlds 2024, taking place in Hawaii, Honolulu specifically. So we have a Pikachu fighting Mew in the stadium here, and in the background, that is Honolulu. You can tell from the hotels on the beach there, people surfing, sailboats going out on there, windsurfing, whatever it is. I don't know, it's really cool that you have the space that the, the whole Worlds Championship is taking place in the actual promo card and this is one of two promo cards we're probably going to see from worlds um, but the fact that this is readily available to anybody the way to get it is to enter worlds 2024 at checkout there is no minimum purchase it's just any purchase so let me go ahead and show you kind of what we'd be looking at there uh, for me where I'm at in the United States $20 would be the minimum and you get free shipping so we're gonna go ahead here and just add in the Greninja it is still available the Kingdra is not available at all very interesting once you are in the cart you have this little section enjoy Pokemon it's very discreet it's not very obvious where do you put the promo code how do you do it this is the spot enjoy Pokemon that is your area to go honey I bet you wouldn't sell me save me anything so Enjoy Pokemon. Now we can type in Worlds 2024. Apply and let's see the magic happen. Boom! You get the promo. I'm not going to be buying this because $30 for that box is just not quite what I would like to spend on it since I got it for 22 already. Um, not delivered yet, but it is coming. I did get tracking. So that's on the way. Um, so I'm not going to pick this up, but I just wanted to show you how that works because of the little caveat that it's enjoy Pokemon rather than some sort of redeem your code here or promo code or something like that I wanted to give you a quick little rundown and walkthrough showing you that that is how you would apply it to your cart and go ahead and get it in this case you qualify for free shipping because you're over the $20 mark however just be aware that you don't have to spend $20 okay $20 is just to get that free shipping in other Pokemon news we have this uh, pertaining to Pokemon Go a uh, little Reddit post that popped up here, just somebody freaking out that they used their Master Ball on a shiny Moltres here. Um, man, that's a bummer. Not guaranteed. Not guaranteed. But if you're familiar with Pokemon Go and you've been playing this game for a while, it came out in 2016. So I think 2016, correct me if I'm wrong, down in the comments below, leave that there. I believe uh, it was in 2016. If you're going to head be playing this, there's a near 100% chance you'll catch the shiny no matter what. So long as you land the ball, whatever it is. So using a Master Ball is devastating. You only get one, maybe two of these if you're lucky in the game at this point. Uh, very, very horrific to have wasted it on a shiny, especially legendary after a raid rally. Um, are shiny Pokemon guaranteed to catch? Uh, not necessarily. If you're using the, um, what is that little device there, the little clip or whatever it is, the... I don't remember where it's at. It's in here somewhere here. The Go Plus. That's right. If you're using the Pokemon Go Plus devices, it's a 50-50 catch rate no matter what. So if you hit a shiny, you may or may not catch it. It falls into that camp once you're using that device. If you're using that device and you're manually going through and finding, your catch rate goes down also. Those are confirmed. It's not confirmed that you get 100% catch rate without that being a part of your setup. But uh, almost always from raids, 
if you get a shiny, you're going to get a 100% catch rate. And the same thing with the legendaries. The, the best ways to get them is through raids or through uh, Giovanni in, in fighting him. So um, a lot of different things there. But very interesting, interesting that that happened. And it's just kind of another reminder if you play Pokemon Go, keep an eye out. Make sure you double check before you start throwing these things. You might run out of stuff and then have that option for the Master Ball. Don't just use it for nothing. Save it until you think you need it. And then see if you can save it a little longer than that. Because seriously, it'd be a terrible thing to waste. A Master Ball is a guaranteed catch so long as you land it. It's guaranteed. That's great and all, but you don't want to waste it when you could have caught the Pokemon a different way. Uh, Ed Sheeran came in the news with Pokemon. Didn't see this one coming. He is in a stadium playing Pokemon Stadium. Um, there's a whole article on this about how... Uh, he probably would have never had a girlfriend if they knew that he was into Pokemon and everything, but let's be honest, I, I don't think that matters. Uh, I have three children. I'm married. I know a lot of PokeTubers out there who are married with kids, so I think it's okay and safe to say that being a little bit of a nerd is not always a bad thing, and having that uh, in your in your background, it's not going to be the end-all, be-all. And to be honest, I think being a nerd is kind of in. I, I don't know if I'm really a nerd, but interested in the market i always watch that stuff and interested in the news as we're looking at it here today on tuesday uh last but not least mcdonald's has announced a new pokemon happy meal promotion now this is in japan specifically all right and i'm going to have some some b-roll here so looking at this here you can see that the quality of toy is so much higher than what we're used to lately here in the states um i don't care about happy meal toys i don't really care i think the quality died out when i was a child um so nothing specifically amazing about that but these actually would be interesting and if we do see them in the states it'd be fun to get them for my kids because they're familiar with these and that's the only way i think a happy meal needs to be enjoyed as an adult is you know for your kids sake please don't be the one going out there and getting it just to get stuff unless you're getting pokemon cards let's be honest i mean i got one right here let me see the most recent one that we did there we go. There's a pack just sitting right there. Um, I've been wanting to open it. Haven't opened it. I have the full set anyways. Doesn't matter. Uh, so, whatever. It's been sitting there on my desk. And Pokemon cards, that's the only excuse when an adult can go get it happy meal. But for the kids, you got all these neat toys and the build quality is better. And it looks like it's actually some sort of a function. So you can actually play with it instead of just have this weird little plastic piece of junk and then it breaks the next day. At least these, you could pretend it's going to work for a day or two. You know, being a compass or whatever. So... Uh, interesting, but we'll see if that makes it to the States. At least for now, looks like it's going to be announced in Japan as a collaboration with McDonald's again with these toys. Uh, what do you think on the different news this week here for Throne of Master Ball when you shouldn't in Pokemon Go? Ed Sheeran, another famous person coming to the surface as a nerd for Pokemon. Or even McDonald's coming up with another collaboration. Not card specific, but interesting. And who's going to go out there and pick up this promo? Again, really easy to get a hold of. Just make sure you pay attention to the Enjoy Pokemon section rather than looking for some other field that would be more obvious or typical among other sites. So that's uh, that's going to do it for us today. For you, one last thing. Make sure you enter to win the Galarian Articuno tin from Crown Zenith, the two three-pack blisters from Stellar Crown, and a Pokemon Mystery Prize for total winners. Got to go back to this video here, and that's going to be your way to enter really easy very simple but make sure you subscribe to the channel like the video you're on now go like that video too and keep boosting it up and get more people and more opportunities but share this share this channel with family and friends there's plenty of you out there i know because these big pokeytubers have millions plural of subscribers and i'm not really aiming there yet i'm trying for 2500 let's see if we can get there first and do one thing at a time uh, it's not a thing until it's a thing so one step at a time i'd like to just take that in the right direction Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.